Welcome to the Core Report. I'm Corporal Clayton Filipovich. And I'm Corporal Ali Beiswinger. We want to extend our deepest condolences to the families and friends of Captain Elizabeth Keeley and First Lieutenant Adam Satterfield. They were killed in a helicopter mishap Friday while conducting training aboard Marine Corps Air Ground Combat Center 29 Palms. The incident is currently under investigation. Semper Fidelis, Marines. Commandant of the Marine Corps General Joseph Dunford released his planning guidance Friday. The report was developed from feedback he received from across the Corps and prioritizes the Marine Corps' combat readiness. General Dunford directs all Marines to read and discuss the guidance, then share their views with senior leadership. Visit marines.mil for more information. Last Tuesday, General Dunford selected Sergeant Major Green as the 18th Sergeant Major of the Marine Corps. Sergeant Major Green currently serves as a Sergeant Major of the 1st Marine Expeditionary Force. He will officially be named Sergeant Major of the Marine Corps on February 20th. Sergeant Major Green had this to say about the honor. I'm, I'm all about, you know, supporting Marines, taking care of warriors and their families. If there's anything to remember, I'm all about mission first, Marine always. Last October, we let you know that a new Special Purpose Marine Air Ground Task Force Crisis Response Unit was deploying to multiple locations in the Middle East. We had the opportunity to catch up with Colonel Jason Baum, the commanding officer of Special Purpose MAGTAF, to learn more about what Marines are doing in the Middle East. And we have Marines that are conducting combat operations in support of ISF in Iraq and we have uh, aviation assets that are actively dropping bombs on Daesh or ISIL forces in Iraq and Syria. If you want to be relevant in today's world, you need to be a self-mobile, self-contained, self-supporting unit. And that's exactly what the Marine Corps brings to the fight, and that has proven itself to be extremely valuable in Operation Inherent Resolve. Other than dropping bombs on the enemy, Marines work side by side with our Iraqi partners to coordinate operations and build partnership capacity. Training is an important part of the MAGTAF's mission. Colonel Baum reminds Marines to take it seriously. Trust your training, always seek self-improvement, and treat every day as though it's your last opportunity to train before you go into combat, because it just may be. Visit marines.mil to stay updated on the MAGTAF's operational activities. Remember, you can catch up on everything else going on around the Corps by logging on to our official social media sites. Thanks for watching, everyone. We'll see you next payday. Right here on the Corps Report.